Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Skull Chains. This is another game. This is another game by Chaocalypse. They did Hayai, the game where you drew through enemies to kill them. It was a really satisfying little arcade score em up kind of game. Skull Chains looks awesome and it comes out October 31st on Steam. You can find the links uh, in the description. Let's give it a go. Undoubtedly a game I'm going to have to do a spotlight on at some point. It's a game I really, really enjoyed called Hammer Fight. And this gives me some major Hammer Fight vibes in the best way. This game, they're, we're going for more like arcadey again. Uh, I think Chaos... Chaos Chaoctalips. I think Chaoctalips, uh, and their, by the way, their name is very easy to say, just saying, um, really likes to go for these arcade ups uh, they, they seem to settle on a really fun gimmick and then build on it and, and make sure that it, it works well with some kind of like progression. So what do we have here? Shoot or long? Kind of like the idea of long, to be honest. Let's do it. Obviously what we're doing is we're swinging our skull friend, but we have other abilities as well. If you couldn't tell, if you don't hit an enemy for a while, then uh, you'll begin to kind of charge up your skull. Oh no. Oh no, we lost our, our jaw. I think long actually is not helping us because it's making us miss. You'll charge up your attack and then when you hit, strike something, you'll do a lot of damage as opposed to just like a single hit. But we have other attacks as well. For instance, we can throw our skull and also have it like kind of magnetized back to us. I kind of do really like just like throwing the skull and seeing if I get lucky. Like that, that was pretty lucky. Faster charge or bigger skull. Let's go for bigger skull. I didn't know that this game had like power ups. So that's actually really cool. Throw that skull. Oh. I think we recovered our, our jaw. We, we recovered our jaw, jawline, like some kind of Chad. I think you can also um, re, like recover your skull through enemies. Yes, you can. Where I'm doing, I'm, I'm experimenting with the gameplay, and it's costing us our lives. I like these. These guys seem like the gym rats of of the of the underworld. I love that the the, the levels are like circular, so that your skull has the maximum chance to kind of bump around and slam and stuff. Ooh, we have bosses. Okay, okay, we can we can happily avoid that. In fact, ooh, ooh, take that, take that. Oh, okay, that was that was pretty easy actually. But this is um, the first level. There are, in fact, I think seven circles of hell. So I'm a little bit concerned <laughs> about how difficult things are going to get. I wonder if I get to keep my upgrades. No, I don't. OK, so you do start over when you enter a new level. That's OK. It feels a little bit peppier now that I've since I've been used to big and long. <sighs> OK, so those eggs hatch into something monstrous. I, I, I hate it. These egg spines what do you want to call them what are we calling them like agreed upon nomenclature for these guys egg spines these those those eyeball eggs kind of remind me of the the weird egg thing from berserk that like stares at you and screams this is a really fun game to bring out on halloween i gotta say it's i mean it, it's got a spooky theme um oh no okay first death Okay, we, I'm not doing a very good job, first of all, of swinging our skull, but second of all, of not taking damage. Oh, damn. Yeah, like I said, it's already getting hard. All right, get, we could pr prior. Oh, man, I took damage on the first one. It's hard to swing and also dodge. Oh, I think I should prioritize, like, dodging. Never mind. Never, never mind. Okay, cool. All right. It might be that those spinal eyeballs have to get to the egg for them to hatch. Sometimes you get really swingy and then your momentum carries you into taking damage. And also when the enemies are like spawning all around you, it's really hard not to take some damage. Okay, just, just dodge. <sighs> just dodge, I said. Yo, just dodge. Yeah, you definitely can recover your skull through enemies, and that is actually kind of amazing. So you do more than swing in this game. You definitely have other abilities, and you should experiment. Really threaded the needle. Oh my god, I'm really threading the needle on this. Ugh. 
the uh the graphics of this game really it almost feels like they're it's like claymation kind of gives me that hylix vibes Ugh. um yeah well that kind of sucks doing well haven't taken damage yet oh yeah I, I had to say it didn't i there's no way i was gonna get rid of anything there oh my god oh, there we go okay cool cool all right let's try shoot this time um, shoot's pretty good. Shoot seems to be, like, the closest enemy. Get rid of those eyeballs. No! Okay, okay. Oh, no. No! I was really hoping I could get- Oh, I just realized I'm at full health. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Why did I do that? That was- Oh my god, okay. Well, it's only the second level, and I, I'm, I think, I think I'm just about as far as I'll ever make it in this game. It's, it's a really difficult game. Also, I'm really bad at it. You know, we're gonna ignore that part. I wish I could like be a bit more creative about throwing the skull and then zooming it through like six enemies. I'm just gonna not bother breaking the egg on some of these levels. I don't think it's actually worth it because it just gets you killed. Even though I still died, it still gets you killed. Well, just in time for Halloween, a game that makes me feel really bad at video games. If you're wondering, by the way, if you can like do funny things with um, increasing or decreasing your mouse sensitivity, you can, but I don't think it actually helps you. I actually find like a lower sensitivity helps me. Okay. No, I was doing such a good job not taking damage. And then I took two damage. Okay, cool. Faster charge, auto aim, throw. Auto aim, throw sounds really good, actually. Yo, that's actually really nice. No! Damn it. I was doing such a good job. Auto aim, throw is actually amazing. I love it. <laughs> no! Okay, we're, we're doing well. Oh my god, that was good. Yes. Um, spiked chains? That sounds really good, actually. Oh my god. Yeah, that's that, this, this could be incredible. With a longer chain, this would be amazing. Since I've got the auto throw, I don't know if it's as good. We, we kind of hit the frame limit there a little bit. Okay, we have a chance here. This level is long. <laughs> I'm having I'm having a great time just throwing and catching the skull. Oh no. No, please don't die at the last second here. Oh god. Okay, please. L last one. Please. Oh my god. Just focus on what's in front of you. Never mind the eggs. Oh, come on. Oh, the f the f the frames. No. I am appreciative though. I got to say of one thing is that I'm really glad this is not a roguelite. All right. Well, that was Skull Chains. I'm sure there's a lot more to that game. Um, unfortunately, I'll never see it because it is a very, very difficult game and I am not very good at it. Maybe there's a MLG YouTuber who can uh, beat the entire game. I uh, my hat's off to them. You know, despite my inability to progress through this game, I still think it's very good. The game releases uh, today and will be uh, $10 USD. Uh, there's definitely a lot of game here, especially if you... I may come back to this and try and, and get past level two, but damn, if you enjoyed this video and my pain, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.